And next game we develop, we're not going to do quality, we're going to do research, because now it's time to level up some staff. Now we got some people with decent energy. We'll stick with them for a little while, until we have... Until we have to hire more people. Okay. So now we're going to start a new game. We'll see if we can afford a uh, development kit for this. We can. We're going to go ahead and uh, purchase it. It means we won't be able to develop a game, but we'll just stick with the contracts for a little while. It'll be worthwhile in a little bit, so... Go. This will give us a chance to level up our staff well. Let's not do that. <laughs> Fortunately, everybody left like at once. That really sucked. I just realized something. Every character on my staff is female. I wonder how many like all-female game development studios there are. <laughs> and I don't mean like if it's a single developer. You know, it has to be like an actual game studio. I'd say probably at least five employees working for them. You know, for like a small indie developer kind of situation, I guess. Okay, there we go. We're going to do one more contract, then we'll have enough money to make a, a video game. Okay. And we're going to level up our staff now. Music died on us again. <laughs> what a shame. It's not important, whatever it is that you want us to do. Okay. Get it through your head. Fortunately, I can't click. Like you, you can click on the characters, but it does that, so it's kind of a waste. Okay. Now I think we might have enough money to develop for the uh, IES. Research. Guess we could do another robot shooter? <laughs> we could do a sim RPG. Sweet. Yeah, it's got a good rating, but it's going to cost too much. So we can't do that, really. Um, I don't have any idea what a life genre is. Like, I have no clue. Someone can fill me in, please. Let's see. Unfortunately, we haven't unlocked any new uh, archetypes for the games yet, so that's unfortunate. We're going to have to spend some of this on training our characters soon to really see that. Um, I guess we'll do a reverse puzzle game. It'll be cheap. Cheap enough to do, so that's what we'll do. Versus is not exactly approachable, but we we'll have some initial appeal, so we'll just do it. And um, I know it's probably a bad idea, but I guess we'll hire somebody because we need to free up her prev thing on there. Their games haven't sold well. Well, let's take a risk on them. <laughs> We're getting 
some pretty good numbers here. I think that's the best start we've had for a game yet. It'd be like the one good game we make would be the one that nobody was interested in because the game based on reversi. <laughs> We don't care one bit. <laughs> All right. So, um, anyways, what was I going to do? Oh yeah, we're gonna level up the staff again. So I think we're satisfied with where they're at. So we're gonna level up our rider now. Hopefully we. Do build up a lot of research data as we go along. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. All right. Hopefully somebody's got some. All right. We got a graphics person now. This will work. There's actually a designer class, which is actually the base graphics person, but she clearly has at least one level on that, so. Yeah, this will probably be the best reverse game on the market. <laughs> For the 16-bit consoles. sound yet so we might be able if we're lucky we might get a 50 on the fun factor which could help don't want to spend any actual money on music so we'll just use emulus around 30 or more at least so except for music but oh and Chindro's announcing a new console again Look, the game kid our good friend the game boy look at the units but we're gonna stick with handheld or handheld consoles for now I think cause soon we are gonna get a new we're gonna build up our money to uh get a new development studio. Um, we're not going to really spend any money advertising for this game. Because I don't really think it'll help sell it that much. We lost more fans. We're in trouble, guys. Okay. <laughs> it might have been worth to, worth releasing this game right away. Okay. Here we go. Up. Oh. It's reversey. <laughs> Why not? Too short? Yeah, it's a board game, you idiot. <laughs> it's like, this game is very interesting, but it's too short. What's wrong with this game? <laughs> okay. Let's see. This we can... It's not going to make us much money, but we can pump this out really quickly. So we're going to go for it. Even though it pays shitty. We'll be able to get through it really quick. 
Eh, I guess we can spend some money in advertising. I didn't think it was going to sell that good right away. Yeah, let's get a marching band to promote our reverse game. <laughs> Why not? Seems like a solid plan. Oh, nice. In the top ten. We almost made the top five with the freaking reverse he gave. Ah, oh, sweet. We're gonna definitely get some fan base now. This is gonna outsell Terminator 2. That's pretty sad. <laughs> yeah. It's already already has. That is just terrible. So 250,000. Pretty awesome. Okay. About time to move to a different office. I was wondering when you would ask.